Hi, I'm Oscar van Deventer, and these are my Hoberman tributes. Uh, you probably know the famous Hoberman sphere invented by Chuck Hoberman, which is a sphere of all kinds of segments, and it can expand from very small to very large. And according to Wikipedia, there are even uh, uh, large versions of several meters. So I really wanted to understand how the Hoberman sphere uh, worked and I started to make my own variations because that's how I learn. So I made this uh, disc that expands like this and it contracts. And let's see how far we can get it. The parts uh, overlap so the interesting thing is that uh, once it's completely expanded like a necklace, it can also collapse. That makes a nice uh, variation. So I also made a triangle that goes from hexagon to triangle. Um, here we have another hexagon that looks uh, symmetrical, but actually uh, it goes together with threefold symmetry. So it goes from uh, six volt symmetry to uh, three volt symmetry. Here we have uh, a square version which looks symmetrical, but again it can uh, go together like this or like that. Here we have uh, another hexagon that uh, is asymmetrical, so you see that the different parts they have uh, slightly uh, different shapes, so it's not an exact uh, hexagon, but uh, something modified. And you can have it uh, inside out and also outside in. So it flips from here to there and back. Here's yet another one. Um, it's a pentagon, or actually a pentagram. And again, it moves uh, inside out and outside in all the way like this. So now the pentagon is on your side and when I move it inside out it's the pentagram that's on your side. Of course uh, some of uh, my experiments uh, failed. I tried to make a very irregular shape. I thought that would be nice but when I tried to uh, move it then uh, ultimately it didn't line up and it didn't work. So also from failure I learned a lot. Anyway, uh, I had a lot of fun uh, printing all these uh, parts and there's probably more to explore and that's also what my question to you is about. Uh, I've been exploring these uh, variations of the Hoberman sphere and what other variations can you come up with? Thank you for watching.